what really happens when you die. According to science, your brain has the ability to create its own electric field. When this electric field is disrupted, it can cause the heart to stop beating and the lungs to stop working. This process is called sudden unexpected death. It can happen in people who are perfectly healthy or in people with underlying health conditions. When this happens, the brain doesn't immediately shut down. It continues to send signals to the body for a short period of time after the heart stops beating. These signals can cause the arms and legs to twitch and the eyes to roll back in the head. This is called the motoric response. It typically lasts for a few seconds, but can sometimes last for up to two minutes. After the motoric response is the vegetative response. During this time, the brain is still active, but it's not sending signals to the muscles. This is when the person will typically stop breathing and their skin will become pale. This lasts for about four to six minutes. During this time, the brain is using up its energy stores. After the energy stores are depleted, the brain cells begin to die. This process is called up. It typically occurs within 10 minutes of the heart stopping. However, some people have reported having a life review during this time. This is when the person will typically report seeing their entire life flash before their eyes. Some people also report feeling like they are floating above their body. These are called lucid dreams or out-of-body experiences. They are thought to be caused by the brain trying to make sense of what is happening. Apoptosis of the brain cells then begins to occur. This is the process of programmed cell death. It s a normal part of the body s function and it s what happens when cells become damaged or are no longer needed. The brain cells die within 10 minutes of the heart stopping. After that, the body begins to break down and the organs begin to shut down. During this time, the body temperature will rise and fall. The skin will become cold and stiff. This is called rigor mortis. It typically occurs within two to four hours of death. As the body breaks down, the smell of death begins to occur. This is caused by the bacteria in the body breaking down the tissue. The smell is typically very strong and it's one of the first signs of death. So what really happens when you die? Your brain activity continues for a short period of time after your heart stops beating. You may experience a life review or out of body experience during this time. After that, your brain cells begin to die and your body begins to break down. This is the process of death.